Well, we want to give a warm welcome to a gentleman who is appearing on the American Dream now for the first time. I want to welcome onto the program James Sharp. He is a top producer, owner, and realtor of the Sharp Real Estate Group. James, thank you so much for being on with us. Thanks for having me, Jennifer. I'm a I'm a pleasure to be here. Well, we're just thrilled to talk to you. I know you are a top producer. You're one of the best in the business. And today we're really going to focus in on new construction in the Dallas area because I know Dallas is the number one new construction market. Is that true? That is absolutely the case. Every time I talk to a buyer, whether they're a local or from out of state, they're always shocked with that uh, statistic. It, uh, it's absolutely true. We have more new homes available here in Dallas-Fort Worth Metro than any other uh, major market in the United States. So why should a buyer consider a new construction home? What are the benefits there? Absolutely. Uh, one of the first things I always tell a lot of my new buyers, especially if they're considering new construction, is, hey, you get to pick your own lot, the location. You heard the adage in real estate, location, location, location. Um, and it's no different on a new construction home because a lot of times you can pick your lot which is a huge benefit for a lot of folks. Some folks are concerned with the facing of the house, the face is north, the south, whatever. Uh, there's also that placement of, hey, I wanna be close to the Nimity Center, I wanna be close to the community pool, maybe close to get in and out. Um, also, sometimes desirability, hey, I wanna be in a cul-de-sac, I want the oversized lot. So a lot of those features of lot placement, selection in the location, and then obviously a huge part is making it custom, picking out your design, your features. Hey, I want a one story, I want a two story. Um, I like having you know the bonus room upstairs. I want the mother-in-law suite. So a lot of those features plays into new constructions, which on a pre home, you're kind of stuck with what you get. Do you believe that new construction homes are a little bit more expensive though than previously owned homes? Sometimes that is the case, but many times there's other factors that play into it. Obviously, a lot of things go into different price ranges of homes and different uh, features in the sales price. But one thing I always try to bring out to every buyer, especially when they are considering new construction versus a pre-owned, is consider all the costs that goes into having a new construction home. And one of the key ingredients is not just on the sales price, but it's the operating costs. So think of you know insurance costs. A lot of folks don't know, a lot of buyers, especially if they're coming into the market, don't know that when you buy a new construction home, your insurance premiums are a lot of times less because there's less risk for the insurance company. If you got a new roof, for example, they're not taking the risk on versus a pre-owned home that's more susceptible to damage. Also, your premiums will be a lot less because there's a lot less to go wrong. Water heaters, uh, major mechanics, air conditioning systems, plumbing systems, electrical systems are usually covered with a nice comprehensive I call it the bumper to bumper warranty within the industry of real estate that uh, usually covers those for the first one, two, five, ten years, depending on builder. So a lot of your carrying costs of what it would cost to like insure it, to maintain it, to upkeep it. And a lot of folks forget that uh, you know when you buy a new home, a lot of times the functionality of these uh, pieces of equipment, major equipment points, will last you know a good 10, 15 years. You're not having to do those updates too. I'm in an older home and I've had expensive updates, redoing kitchens and bathrooms and updating all these fixtures, which could add to tremendous expense. Mm -hmm. So when you combine all that into it, sometimes I've had clients, surprisingly, and especially you figure also energy efficiencies, well, a lot of times electric bill is less because energy efficiencies, high efficiency air conditioners or added insulation brings down utility costs. So when they figure all those factors from insurance, utility, maintenance, and updates, it sometimes plays out where it's the same, if not less, than a pre-owned home. And we should mention that typically new construction will highlight the newer trends, right? The open concept, I think, is incredibly right. popular right now, isn't it? Absolutely. I always tell people, buy as new a home as you can afford and buy in the right location. Um, desirability of those plays into new construction because you can, a lot of times, like I mentioned, pick your location, pick your features, and pick those trends. And those are our key ingredients of when you buy a new home and you can design all that into that. Fantastic. Well, great tips today, James. Thank you so much for being on The American Dream. Thanks for having me, Jen. I enjoyed it. And for our viewers watching, we encourage you to follow us along on social media or go to our website, AmericanDreamNetwork.tv, and we'll be right back with more of the show.